What it do, K Life Squad? Back at it with another video, y'all. I'm tired today, y'all. I ain't even gonna lie. I ain't even gonna hold you. I need at least one more day to get my mind right, man. At least one more, y'all. Oh, I'm like, why is the seatbelt thing going off and I got on my seatbelt? It's because I got a couple things in the seat, so they think it's another. Let me actually move it. I don't need to think it's somebody else in here. There you go. So, yeah, y'all, I'm tired today. I ain't even going to hold you. Pray for strength. Oh, Father God, day 17. I'm praying for strength, Lord, across the world. For everybody, not just myself. Everybody. We need the strength, Lord Jesus, to keep it together. <laughs> we got to keep it a stack. We need that strength to keep it together, Lord. But I know he'll give it to us. And better days are coming, y'all. So, God, just hold on, y'all. Just hold on for me, please. We got better days coming. I'm praying for it. God knows our needs. He knows our wants. He knows our desires. It's going to come through. We just got to keep on holding on. So we on day 17, y'all. I'm feeling good, man. I'm starting to get back to my regular self. Although it's been 14 years, I feel like I'm getting back to my natural state. <laughs> um, I won't change anything. Um, I'm just getting better, y'all. I'm growing, I'm glowing, and I'm getting better. So, yeah. It's a beautiful day. It was raining last night. I wonder if that's got something to do with how I feel. Like, I feel a little drowsy today. Usually, I'm, you know, <laughs> but I feel, I definitely feel a little drowsy today, y'all. So that's why I need y'all. Pay for strength. Leave me some strength in the comments below. Leave me some strong arms. <laughs> that's that strength. You feel me? So until I get back later, y'all, to see how I feel at the end of my day. I hope I'm not yawning all day. I hate when I'm tired and I just be yawning all day. I don't like that. But we're going to go ahead and give the big, the big guys some praise and some thanks, y'all. Father God, we thank you. Thank you for allowing us to see a new day, a new day we've never seen before, Lord Jesus. Because you saw fit for us to see it, Lord Jesus, we just want to say thank you. We want to give you your praise, Lord. We want to give you your mercy. We're not coming here to ask you for anything. We just simply want to give you your thanks, Father God. Thank you for strength. Although I need a little more, but thank you for the strength to get up this morning and be on my way, you know. Thank you for discipline, Father God. Day 17, who thought you did though you already knew it was already written so lord i thank you lord i love you lord i adore you i just ask that you give everybody strength everybody discipline everybody just everything that they need in their lives father god on the sound of my voice father god i ask that you keep us i ask that you continue being at the footstool of every walk that we take father god I ask that you just continue being the almighty God that you are. Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Rapha, Lord Jesus, our provider, our healer. Father God, thank you for it all. Lord, we love you and we adore you. I ask that this prayer be sent straight up to your heaven gates, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Y'all, I love y'all. I'm going to be back later. I don't do energy drinks and stuff, so I'm not sure what I can use to uh, get a little boost. But uh, I'm going to just get it the natural way, the natural state. And that's from my God. He got me. He know what I need and what I want. What all I, all of us need and want. So, yeah, y'all. Till I get back later at the end of my day, y'all. I love y'all. Stay encouraged. Stay motivated. Um, Stay everything. Stay uplifted. And continue being a light to somebody. Love on everybody, y'all. We are not here to pick and choose who we love and who we want to love. And just love everybody. You see somebody in help and you're able to help them. You see someone in need and you're able to help them help them. 
please don't don't go short of anything. I love y'all till I get back. Peace. Hey, shout out to my floater, man. He took care of all the red plum yesterday. That's a blessing. I ain't got to do no red plum. This is not mine. But I just wanted to come back and tell y'all, I was in this weight loss challenge with my sister and uh, got another two friends. Well, a friend that I know and a friend that they know. And y'all, when I believe they dropped out on me this morning, and I was winning. I was winning. Can y'all believe they dropped out on me? So now I don't want a contest and I don't even get the reward. But my sister did send me my reward. Shout out to my sister, but I'm just happy to know I won. <laughs> even without the reward, I won, y'all. So y'all pray for me. Uplift me. Today isn't, I ain't gonna say today is bad, but I'm just, I'm not moody. I'm just not in the same space. And it's just because, like everybody, I just want more. And trying to do more for my family and try to be more for my family and my peers and my friends and people around me. So, y'all send me some encouraging words in the comment, man. Uplift me as I uplift y'all, as we uplift each other. God is good. God is amazing. So, I'm not complaining. You just got to be honest. When one of them days is just not those days, you just... I need a picker up or today, y'all. So, I'm just hoping I get that somewhere someday i mean somewhere somehow on this today but yeah y'all i'm be back once i finish get my stuff together peace what it do y'all and i'm back the day is complete i'm here at sissy bone grabbing some chicken and rice for my family today was an emotional day y'all i ain't even gonna hold you we gonna keep it to stack um I'm just at the transition part of my life. Anybody that, you know, been through anything and you just want to be great and do better, you know what I'm saying? It, it comes with a lot of emotions, most importantly. And I'm just, I'm at that phase of my life right now, y'all. And I just want to be great. I want to do more for my family. Um, we've been working hard so long, you know what I'm saying? And I know it's coming. I know God is working on it. And I know God is going to deliver. It's just... The weight game and getting that, and it, you know, it's all good because you gotta go through this process. But I'm gonna be vulnerable and I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Today just was emotional wreck for me, but it's all good. I came out on top. I didn't do what the devil wanted me to do. I was in my head, heavy on my thoughts, and I didn't let it conquer me. So I'm just excited that I was able to push through. And we here, uh, day 17 is a wrap. I'm so excited. Um, I'm stronger than ever because of God, because of my family supporting me, my baby, just everybody really just being an amazing help to me. And I, I can't thank them enough for uplifting me and pushing me to be better. And I'm just so excited about that, y'all. So, yeah. We on day 18 tomorrow. <laughs> it's born, y'all, and I'm stronger than ever. So I'm excited about that grabbing some chicken wine. If you ever in Miami area, you don't know about Sissy Moon, get on it. So yeah, I'm excited. Um, I feel good. How I'm feeling, I feel good. I'm starting to feel like this is just my day to day now, y'all. I'm not even, you know, uh, beat <laughs> for real, for real. Oh, I'm so excited, y'all. Next week, I got an appointment. Um, I'm about to start my dentistry transition. Um, I'm so happy for that. That's going to bring a whole new person, um, a whole new outlook. And just, I'm just happy and I'm ecstatic to be going through this. And most importantly, this is something I've been waiting for. This is something I've been saving for. This is something that I've been needing to do for a while. And I'm just so excited that my time has come and it's on the day. So I'm going to show y'all my chicken when I get my chicken for sure though. I'm actually about to be on my way to church. We actually have leadership meetings this week, so I'm gonna go ahead and head to church. I'm a little late, but I had to get my family some um, dinner before I actually turned it in. So I appreciate y'all. I appreciate everybody for rocking with me. I appreciate y'all for, uh, you know, uplifting me, giving me the care, just, you know, telling me to stay strong, telling me to keep going, because I am. Came too far. 17 days, why would I turn back now? That'd be a fool. It's God's plan for sure. 
So I appreciate y'all, y'all, man. And this is a no negative channel. We I don't deal with negativity and we not even promoting that. So I appreciate all the positivity and all the good, you know, comment and just let me know that y'all came through. You feel me? So just keep rocking with me. Um, until I get my food, I'm going to show y'all chicken from Sissy Bone. It's five with that pickly and I got me a little small thing of rice. Yes, sir, ski. So, yeah, until I get my food, y'all, I'm going to be back, all right? Don't post. That's, that's even better. Don't post. If you don't want comments, don't post or turn off your comments. If not, it's fair game. I am a TikTok influencer. If you on TikTok, follow me. Every time you want. Listen, there's some things I see. There's some things I see, I go straight to the comments because I'm there for the comments. I need to see what people are saying. I need to see what people, I'm only here for the comments because I know this is about to be some mess. Yeah, that's just real. Everything I have is open for comments and there are some things that I've seen I didn't like but I didn't make no beef about it. I didn't do no video to respond to the comment. I just deleted it. That's correct. Or if it was serious enough for me, I blocked the person. So you don't get to do that again. Mm -hmm. Learn yourself through me. Oh.